Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls and this is our daily angelic message for March 31st, 2024. Happy Easter to anybody who celebrates Easter. I celebrate Easter, that's how I know it's happening. All right, <laughs> so, anyway, let's get to our message today. Um, hold on, I want to shuffle these a little bit better. I meant to do that before I started recording. Da, 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 yeah, yeah, like there. All right, so 45, sad embrace. I'm telling you, this doesn't have to necessarily mean anything bad is happening to you personally or with people you know. It's just, there. oh gosh, I, there might be like, uh, I hate saying stuff like this. There might be a public figure who passes away and or we get news of a public figure like this is somebody that whether you like this person or not that it's still sadness it's still a whoa I can't believe that just happened um some some incredibly sad news coming out um and I'm sorry to say guys this might be might be a sad event as well Opportunity. Someone's taking the opportunity. <sighs> because, you know, especially people who celebrate Easter on, on March 31st. Because um, I, I think there's an Orthodox Easter. Is Am I right on that? I'm not well educated on that. But let me know in the comments if you know about that stuff. Um, hold on. I don't like this. Hold on. Yeah, exactly what you're thinking. There could be one of those. It's like the magic stream card with the sad embrace. Okay, so we can read this a couple of different ways. What I'm picking up is that someone is like almost, now hang with me here. There's a couple layers of messaging. Someone's a little bit delusional. And they think they're doing something really righteous and good, but it's just horrifying. It's just horrifying. So check the energy. Now, technically... Uh, time is not linear, obviously, uh, and especially with the angels. They don't really go with linear time. So it could be around this day. But this could, I'm hearing opportunity. So someone is taking the opportunity that people are maybe at rest, going to church. Um, please, if you are a part of, especially a religious organization, especially like a church, make sure you have security. I know that's awful. That is so awful. Trinity Wall Street, make sure you have security there. I know you do. That used to be my church when I lived in New York. Um, I know you do. Make sure they're well trained. I hate to be that person. I'm going to put a heightened alert on, on this day. And I know that's, that's horrible on a day like this. Okay, so watch out for like, I'm sorry for the terminology, but this is what we do so we don't get blocked, but like pew pews, okay? Like, you know what I'm talking about? Um, that, and then there's also this image of, it looks like a black SUV running onto a field where there are little eggs around, um, trying to plow through a crowd. Do not, I, I know this sounds wild and I don't have a better answer for you. I'm not encouraging you to be in fear. Okay, but listen to your instincts. God will forgive you if you choose not to go to church on Sunday, on, on Easter Sunday. I know that's wild and some people would never do that. Okay, but God will, God will be fine with you if you feel like you need to stay home. Okay, again, I'm not trying to make anybody fearful or anything like that just because it won't happen everywhere, obviously, but there, there's something going on here. Now, the other layer besides the heavy messaging is you're having to let, it's the same theme. You're having to let something go for you personally so that you can manifest something, right? Um, it's death and resurrection. That's what it is. Okay. Now, if you want a personal reading with me, right now is the time to do it. I've been staying on top of these like a crazy person. Okay. Angelsouls444.com for standard readings. Always check my community tab. I will keep you posted just about every day. Maybe not every day, but most days about um, where we're at with the wait time. As I've been saying in plenty of videos, my schedule will be changing in the next few weeks. I'll still be doing readings, but you know, like slots availability for live readings 
<coughs> it might, I might not be able to get you in, <coughs> pardon me, in the same week. It might have to be scheduled out a couple of weeks, you know, things like that. Um, and maybe certainly there's not going to be a one day turnaround with standard readings. So just keep that in mind. Uh, angelsouls444.com for standard readings. If you want a live session or a live teaching course on how to connect with your angels, angel mediumship, how to work with an angel, email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com. I just got like that. You guys know what this is where you go deaf in one ear and then there's like a ping. Sign up for a reading if you want. What do you guys want me to say? It won't always be like this. This is metamorphosis. And there's a 25 on there. And that becomes 7 in angel numbers or numerology. It won't always be like this. So please don't get yourself into a space of disheartenedness. Protect the kids at all costs. Protect the kids at all costs. You guys have a region? Okay, I just heard Louisiana that came through strongly. This won't be the only place where something might be going on. They're saying protecting the children is what needed to be happening all this time. And that's part of that delusion, right? The sort of spell that we're under where people are like they see something going on, but they go, huh, that's weird. And something shuts down and keeps them from taking action. That's not just fear. There's something that gets put upon us so we get to a place where we don't want to handle it. Okay, Louisiana. Okay, I'm seeing floodwaters. I don't know if something floods. Um, in your case, there could be storms, flooding, things like that. So be aware of that and be prepared. Okay, so you can stay safe. This is also where I'm seeing like a vehicle trying to come on to the field. I pray that this doesn't happen. I don't want it to happen. Feel free to come back and be like, you were wrong, you were wrong, you were wrong. Go ahead in the comments. I hope I'm wrong. Say, you were wrong, amen, after we get done with this day, right? Come back and say that. Um, keep children away from bodies of water. <sighs> just, just watch the kids, especially like if there's an Easter egg hunt. Be careful of that. They're taking me to Southern California. What's happening in Southern California? Okay. This is Magical Shapeshifter. It's 52. We have another seven. So this is showing like we're guiding you. We're going to let you know. We're going to protect you before these things go down. Now the shifting is what I pick up on when it comes to California. California, you get earthquakes all the time. I know some of you are like, what? Telling us about what we heard. <laughs> Understandable. I know. But uh, now's the time. Now's the time to get ready. Okay. Are we done? I think so. We'll, we'll, we'll leave it there. Happy Easter. I'm sending you all so much love. And for real, take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.